Hi, I'm Rick Cox. We talked about before about me flipping a house. Here's a house that I just bought. It's in Powhatan, Virginia. I'm getting ready to flip it. I haven't done anything to it yet. So what I want to do is kind of take you through the house. It's a, a house with a basement. It's got an outbuilding here and it's got a garage in the back. It had, when I bought it, it had a tree that had fallen down because of a storm. So got it at a really good price. We're going to totally gut the inside, put a new kitchen, put, uh, it's got uh, moisture issues in the basement and also some foundation issues that we're going to fix. So what I want to do is kind of take you through this transition, take you inside of it now, show you some pictures of it so you can see before and after and what we're going to do. Okay. Follow me. Let's go inside now and see what we've got. Okay, when I bought it, it didn't have vinyl siding. The roof's only about five years old. And one, one thing I do like about it is it has some nice wood floors, so that's good. But let's go in and see what the kitchen looks like. All right, here's the kitchen. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take all these cabinets out, all the flooring. We're gonna put all new cabinets in, put a refrigerator over here, uh, put all new appliances in. So this will be totally wiped out, even the new floor. Um, very nice door to the backyard. As you can see, it's got a deck back here with the garage and a little deck here. So we'll be fixing that up also. This uh, property has like a little over an acre of land. So let's do it. Now I'm going to take you into some bedrooms. And as you can see here, the floors here are actually in pretty good shape in the living room and also in the hallway. The part, there's a fireplace up here and down in the basement. It might be too dark to get down to the basement to show you. But here's the stairs to the basement to your, to your left, to my right. And it goes down to a basement. Here's the, it's a bath and a half. Here's one of the bathrooms, the full bath. Haven't figured out all the lights yet, so we're having an electrician come Monday. Um, also, here's all, there's three bedrooms. That's one bedroom. This is the second bedroom. And I'm going to take in and show you the master bedroom now. Back this way. You can see also the whole house needs painted. This is the master bedroom. And it's also got a closet here and a half bath. downstairs real quick. Now it might be too dark down here for you to see, but we will we'll go down here and look. This is, uh, downstairs is going to be totally gutted again. We're going to take all the drywall off. We're going to take, uh, we're going to basically strip it all the way down. All the carpeting is going to come out. And there's a big room here with the fireplace that's probably too dark to see. And there's no electricity down here for some reason. And then this over here. Um, here's a, like the utility laundry room over here, and then here's like another room that basically goes to the outside. Um, like I said, all this is going to be stripped down. We're going to totally take everything out, solve the moisture issue, issues and the uh, um, structural issues, get that fixed. Already have estimates for that. That'll start next week. And then we'll um, basically put drywall back up and new floor. Okay. Uh, we're going to go outside now to the building out here. This is a spare building. Don't really know what it's for, but it's out here. We've got some issues with the the water basically comes down and comes right here, and it's been going into the building. So what we're going to do is we're going to drill, we're going to take the cement out right here, about a foot in front of the building, and then we're going to do a little fill it with gravel so the water will go shoot to both sides, and also any water will not be retained in here; it'll go to the side. That's going to be done. And this building, we're going to basically dig around so it will be stood up. But just a, basically a nice big building. Don't really know what you're going to use. We're going to strip all this out because it had some moisture issues because of all the water that used to come down here and come in. So.
I'm also going to post pictures on my Facebook, so if you're interested in some of the rooms that were dark, too dark to see, I'll post those there if you want to see them. Um, here's the rest of the yard, the garage again. Besides the garage, you've got a nice little, uh, like, picnic area, um, which would be nice uh, for to picnic out or whatever you want to do. So, uh, basically, tomorrow what we're going to do is we're going to start cleaning up the yard first and then start taking everything out of the house. We're going to get a trash container or a big... Uh, container to basically throw all the insides out and then uh, we'll start looking for cabinets, um, getting paint, uh, getting the contractors here, the uh, foundation repair people and the uh, moisture people to get the step fixed. So, hope you keep following. Talk to you later.